Have you ever wondered what is really going on in mosques? What is happening in these mosques? Are they having secret talks, secret meetings? Are they planning something? I don't know. These things just go through your head, right? So maybe we should go find out, shall we? I'm going to take you on a little journey. I'm not going to call them and be like, I'm coming. No, I'm just going to show up and I'm going to say, show me around. Show me where your secret weapons, your stashes, your plans, where, I don't know, <laughs> your maps are. Show me around. It's a dangerous mission. Let's go. Let's find out. Let's find out whether there's something going on in these buildings. I'm not going to call them and be like, I'm coming. So they don't try to hide anything from me. Nah, I'm just going to show up and be like, here I am. Show me around now. So, let's go. This is when it goes down at night time. You should never try this at home, yeah? Here we are. So yeah, these these are the bathrooms. This is where you do your wudu. So I just came back guys, and <laughs> I'm here, alive, two feet, two legs. Matter of fact, I came back holier. So we were expecting a lot of things, weren't we? We were expecting ammunitions, plans, secret books, whatever it was. But here's how it went. I walk into the mosque, and I'm instantly greeted by a guy straight out of Fox News and CNN. You know, the big bearded guy. With, with the stamp on his head, Middle Eastern looking, and he just smiles at me and says, Salaam Alaikum. I was scared at first, but then he just looks at me and goes, Salaam Alaikum, and walks off with a smile on his face. And this is 100%. You could you heard it in the video where I replied to Salaam Alaikum also. Then I went into the bathroom where they cleansed themselves, and basically that's where they cleaned themselves, and there was a, a guy in the bathroom I didn't know about. So I sat down, and... I was washing my feet and he came out looking like confused. Who's this guy? Is this guy homeless? Because sometimes they take homeless people in and, and feed them and whatnot. And he's like, what's this guy homeless? I was like, nah, mate. I didn't really, he didn't really talk to me. He just looked at me with confusion and I just smiled back and nodded and then he walked off. So then I finished. I went to the prayer room. That's the big room where usually you have preachers and people praying. And <laughs> I was expecting people to get up and look at me and be like hey what are you doing here I just walked off and sat down and only one or two people lifted their heads because most of the people were reading the Quran and others were praying and the guys that lifted their head they just looked up to see what's happening obviously you can't miss a guy who's wearing pink in the mosque and they went back doing doing their thing and I picked up a book went through few books and there was nothing there that we 
wanted to see. So, I picked up one of these books that I showed you, and it was just the basics of the religion. And that's it. I walked out. Nobody said anything. Literally, nobody even spoke to me except for the Salam Alaikum. So, cry me a river, I guess. I already knew the outcome, but for those that get brainwashed by these activists on YouTube where they go harassing mosques and people entering mosques and they turn it out to be like, oh, um, you, you guys know who these guys are, and they make it turn out to be like, you know, it's the other way around. No, but when you go picking on people, and then you turn around, it's like, it's like the bully in the school. It's like those bullies in school where they slap you and they run behind the teacher and you chase him and he goes, teacher, he did it. He's trying to hit me. That's exactly what these activists are doing. You know those activists, activists, fools, little chihuahuas barking, right? You guys know them. We've got one from, two from the UK, one in Australia. You, I'm not going to even, they don't even deserve to be mentioned, but you know who they are. Those are the people that have been brainwashing you guys on YouTube. And I'm here, just prove them wrong, with a simple video. Thank you for watching. And to those people we say, cry me a river, you ticks. Peace and love, just like always.